Thatcher from Free Skier Magazine sitting here in the Boston Red Sox clubhouse at Fenway Park with none other than Mr. Tom Wallish. Tom, you're a huge Pittsburgh sports fan. Um, what does this mean to you to be at Fenway Park having a ski competition? It is outrageous. I can't even describe it. I mean, I've been a sports fan for as long as I can remember and obviously know the history here. And I'm not a Red Sox fan, but man, you still like, you get goosebumps walking through here. You, you know, in the clubhouse, you're in the locker rooms, you're walking through the dugout, you're walking through the tunnel to come out on the field. It is like crazy to know, you know, there were so many major games played here, World Series played here. It's, it's crazy history and it's really cool. It's a really unique experience. Yeah. Um, so, like, the stage of this, there's 25,000 tickets sold this weekend. That is, like, a bigger audience than, I mean... Almost than, any other yeah. one, one-off one ski competition in history. It's yeah, crazy. Yeah, exactly. So it's really cool. What is that... How is this going to change? How is this going to progress, this sport that, we're, that we love? I think it's just so cool for, for the mainstream audiences, the, the, you know, the audience that lives in Boston or has been to Fenway and sees that ramp built, they're like, holy crap, like, what is going on? I got to go check this out. And, and to get more people that, like, maybe don't know about free skiing and know they can go to Vermont and ski or know they can go somewhere and do turns, to get them into, like, knowing what this sport is and that this is an Olympic event, this is a real-time sport. I mean, it's it's going to blow up. Twin tip, twin tip sales, you know, skis. We need... More people riding cool skis, doing cool tricks, and yeah. having more fun skiing. So I think it's going to help uh, exponentially. Thank you. Yeah. Well, I mean, just this... hopefully no more socks jerseys yeah. and no more boss oh, logos out on. there. Come on, go pads, go socks, all day. Um, <laughs> but seriously though, like they, since you started competition skiing, like way back when, the sport has come so far. I mean. Yeah. We're in Bo we're in Fenway Park right now. Listening you to guys, the national anthem yeah, right I mean, now. There was a competition in LA last year, Air yeah. Style. I mean, obviously we've done City Big Airs before, but it seems like they're it's going more and more in that direction. And I mean, yeah. obviously, and you are heavily involved with uh, the North Face Park and Pipe Open Series, yeah. virtual competition. Like, touch on that. What do you, what do you, where what direction do you think that the sport is headed? In? It's, it's going so many di different directions, which I love. I mean, we're doing a primetime event, live on TV, live in Fenway Park, like middle of everywhere. And at the same time, if you can't get invited to this, you still have the opportunity with all these companies, you know, North Face especially, bringing in a virtual, an online competition where you can still do the same stuff, but filming with your friends. And you can make a name for yourself which is something that didn't exist when I was a kid. And to be able to win that virtual competition and then win that, you know, be known for that and then get an invite to something like this after getting known for something like that, it's just like, it, it's a clear path and it's way easier than when I was a kid. You didn't know what to do. You're like, how am I gonna, how do I become a pro skier? I don't know. And there's so many different options now that it leaves it up to you. And it's, it's really fun. I think it's, it's amazing, you know, how many different opportunities there are now. Certainly, definitely. I mean, I'm overzealous being in this building and hanging out with you in here, so it's pretty awesome. And uh, unfortunately, you didn't make the finals tonight, but you're here cheering everyone on. We just heard the national anthem, so uh, I think it's time for us to get out there. Yeah, should we get out there and watch? It's going to be a good show. The guys that made it in are uh, hungry go-getters, and I think it's going to be a good show. Who's your pick, male, female? Oh, man. Uh, Swiss kid Fabi and Bosch qualified first, just won a gold medal at X. He, I've been watching him for a couple years. Crazy, crazy kid. He's always down to go hard. I think he's got it for guys. And then on the girls, ugh. I mean, I might have to go. I mean, Devin Logan was looking good and Maggie Boys, and I'm going to go American, for, American for first and second. I think those two are going to pull out all the stops. I dig it. I dig it. Well. We'll see you out there, bud. Enjoy watching the competition. With Sounds you. good. You're the man. Go Pirates. Go Sox.